Hi folks, um, in this video I'm going to show you a click view variable called verbatim and um, basically if you just check the uh, help menu and you can see if you scroll down, there's one down here set verbatim equals one um, and basically what it does is if you set verbatim equals one and add it to the script it will, rem it will keep any preceding spaces uh, within a field so I'm going to demonstrate that here now so what we can do is we can go into the script um, I'll just start from scratch again so what we're going to do is select the file uh, it's just a it's a test file so I'll call it verbatim click on finish now if we go into the Excel file itself, you'll see that we've got a product code with uh, preceding spaces and same on uh, this value here. So if we just minimize this and go back into click view. Now if we reload that Excel spreadsheet and add those two fields, you'll see that unlike the Excel spreadsheet, there's no spaces at the start of uh, Q004 and Q005 product codes. And how we can get around that is actually create a variable or say set verbatim equals one. Now if we reload the same Excel file, you'll see that it keeps the preceding spaces before the start of the product code. And that's pretty much it. Um I haven't used it very often, but again, you never know so. I hope this helps and I'll see you next video. Cheers.